right here, right in front of me. Fish on, guys. <laughs> hey what's up guys i'm here at the raid Tim bay trying to look for some strikers feels good putting on my waders again for 2021 it was a long time coming see if i could catch something on a lure first um if anything if i can't catch it i'm gonna go on a gonna use some blood bonds. Quick double union on here. My first choice is gonna be a SP minnow. Looks like there's something jumping right over there. Water is like totally calm. There's like no wind. All right guys, first cast. Fish on, guys. Fish on. Got it. First one. Something's wrong. Not bad guys, looks like a good size keeper man. There we go guys. That's a pretty nice one. Alright guys, something's wrong with the gears. It's not working properly, it's making a lot of noise. So I do have one more reel, I'm gonna change it out. The only thing I have right now is my Totuda 3000 LT. Back in action baby. Shunk. All right, nice and easy. There's some stripers right in front of me. Right here, right in front of me. Nice. <laughs> right in front of me, guys. All right, guys, got it. Fish on, guys. There he goes. He's gone. Oh my gosh. Guys, they're right here. Right in front of me. Right next to the shore. I'm gonna skim my SP minnow on the shore. Nice and slow. Have your rod down so when you hook up, you can bring it up. Fish on, guys. Nice one. Ah, got it. He looks like a 28 inch. He's a keeper. And I'm back. There he goes. All right, 
You just caught a keeper that was number five. That was the biggest one of the day. It's pretty nice. Very healthy fish. guys another nice one look at this beautiful fish man let him go after my bait already yeah oh let's go Let's go. There we go. All right, guys. That's like number six. Just let him go. Nice and healthy. Number three, three in a row, baby. Three in a row. Ah, I lost it. Lost, lost it. I mean, last time the darter was working, so. I don't know. There we go. Like every cast, guys. Literally every cast. <clears throat> Yeah. Oh! Bus. Right in front of us. Not even went too far. Right here. Oh! Shit. <laughs> oh, shit. They're on my ear. They're right here. <laughs> that was mine. <laughs> There's more there. There's more there. I want to change the top water. It's gonna be real fun. Okay, everybody promise not to tell anyone there's a day bite. <laughs> <laughs> Fish on. You gotta get the sand off that thing for the picture, man. Come on. Are you bad or torpid? <sighs> All right, there we go. All right, look at that. Literally every cast, guys. Woo! Beautiful fish. It's about like 20 inches. Let's let him go. There we go. Oh man. I'm definitely on the fish today, baby. Definitely on the fish. There we go. Fish on, guys. Oh, shit. Fish on. The top water, guys. Let's go right here. Let's go.
27. Fat one though. Nice. Got one. Yeah, in the top water. Woo, this one's a screamer. Yeah. He was like, what happened? Ah, that's alright. That's not a bad thing. That's not a bad thing. Yeah. Awesome, awesome, awesome. The guys are hitting this one here. Top water. Got it. Ah, finally on the top water. That's what I'm talking about. There he goes. He's free. That's easy. Bite died out, definitely. And today I was actually using my land glass GLB 8 foot rod. It's rated for half to two ounces. It's a custom rod from TBJ in Connecticut. I'll leave a link up on their bait shop, tackle shop. You could get these from the factory for $375, but he could build it for me custom for $375. So um, that's what I did. Uh, I got my initials right here, RS. Uh, it's an 8 foot. It's similar to the John Skinner GLB. It was like a 9 foot I think he uses. It's a very versatile rod. Uh, you can catch pretty far with this. It's very thin. Um, this my custom rod. Very nice. It'll handle SP minnows and poppers and stuff like that. So. You saw how it goes. Thanks for watching. Oh.